area, a local rice production hub in the Shio Sudoku district of the country's capital, Accra. From large farms to melon factories and a variety of what farmers believe to be the tastiest rice grains in the country, it is no surprise to see people travel from miles to get to the village, whether for personal or large-scale purposes, when it comes to rice. Francis, not his real name, is a rice farmer currently preparing for the next crop season after a successful harvest. This type of rice is a new seed that they, uh, they brought from Kumase Tech. Okay. Yeah. The so GMOs? Yes, GMOs. But only we don't know the actual name yet. I planted some small one and then I see that the yield is very good. Mm. So I'm trying to multiply it so that it should be more. For these rice farmers, the demand for the local rice is a boost as many have had to double production, especially in the last crop season, to be able to meet with these demands. But the journey to this community is not always a pleasant one for both residents and visitors. This is the situation. Farmers who have to move from Esutuare all the way to the Esutuare Junction go through this kind of stress just to get their produce onto the market. Imagine cars breaking down from farms. Imagine farmers being stranded just because they do not have easy transportation to the market. Mami Koko is one of such farmers. <laughs> I'm on my way to Agomenya, but I've been here for a while due to the bad road. One will think the bad roads and transport hikes are not the only reasons to be concerned for the price you pay for local rice on the market. There is a looming concern, artificial shortage. So one of the processes that I'm really trying hard to master here in this tutorial is the drying of the rice and this is something that most of the farmers here do whenever rice is brought fresh from the farm but at this rice miller where i'm currently at there seem to be a great concern buyers have come but there's no local rice available for them and i am baha the barrenty guest house and an I have been here since Monday to get some local rice, but to no success. I've had to stay back at an extra cost, hoping to get some. She tells me this shortage, which means she would pay higher to buy the product, coupled with the transport fares, which are already high due to four hikes, but even higher because of the bad nature of the roads, will be factored into how much she sells the product eventually. On the market, we sell a margarine of local rice for five cities. Uh, your friends say uh, abroad food dinner yeah, could be seven cities compared to the foreign oh, one in, at in seven cities. Our uh, buyer, we Christmas, even your local rice. Hmm. But in December, this can be ten cities. Because of the trade price. It's been an interesting journey trying to be able to understand what has been contributing to the increase in local rice prices, especially on our market. This is the Akuse Estuary Road. It's not different from what I experienced on the Estuary Road. But you can tell that in all this, bad roads continue to contribute heavily to the cost of local produce, especially on our market. Reporting for Three Business, my name is Della Michelle. I came to you from Isutrari and Akusei.